Although that's uh, before she transitioned. Yeah, so. I understand that now. So uh, this is, uh, you are with Veterans for Peace? Right, my name is Michael Kramer. I'm the president of Chapter 21, Veterans for Peace. Uh, How Northern many chapters New Jersey. do they have? We have around 160 chapters throughout the United States, and we're now globalizing. We have chapters in the UK, in Ireland. Are most of the founders from the Vietnam War, you had a big influx from the Iraq and Syrian War? Most of the founders were both from World War II, some the Korean War, and the Vietnam War. Uh, Has there been an influx from the latest war or not? Yes. Uh, at a recent convention last week, I think 10% of the people who attended were post-911 veterans. And what do you do for, what are you trying to do for Chelsea Manning? Well, we're trying to get the word out about her situation in prison. She's imprisoned at the U.S. Military Disciplinary Barracks located at Fort Leavenworth, Kansas. Is that solitary or something? Uh, she has been in solitary as a result of some issues she faced that resulted in her attempting to commit suicide. Um, actually, I don't have the latest update today, but she was put in solitary. It was amazing how the, I will say, I was actually somewhat impressed at the willingness of like all the major media to accept uh, Chelsea's transition and start using the female gender pronoun. There was a day when that might not have happened. Right. Uh, that's a tribute to the trans community uh, from Stonewall to uh, those who died in this struggle like Marsha P. Johnson. Marsha P. Johnson lived with me for 12 years. Oh, my, really? Yes, I okay. had that button on. This was her. Oh, wow. And we okay. produced Pay It No Mind, which you can see for free on YouTube. I'll give you a flyer oh, for it. Oh, okay. So, really, uh, the recognition... Is there any really good documentary on uh, Chelsea? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. There should be. Th there definitely should be. Does he, is she able... I mean, all these pronoun mistakes. Is she able to write and communicate freely with people on the outside? Um, are there people that Not exactly. Can visit her? There are limitations. Uh, she's in a prison with very, very tight security. It's a military prison. Um, so it's worse she, than a normal prison, right? More restrictive or not? More restrictive. Um, perhaps less undisciplined internally, but I don't want to get into that. Um, in some ways more protective than if she was in uh, you, you Rahway a... State Prison in New Jersey. But really the issue is why she's in prison. She told, the, she was able to tell the American people the truth about what has happened in Afghanistan, the truth about what's happened in Iraq, the truth yeah, about I, I... how the State Department views the world. To their not, internal correspondence. I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not making an issue here. I'm just uh, repeating things that I've seen. Heavy discussions on all of this. Now, WikiLeaks supposedly did some vetting with what he released uh, material through the New York Times. But the argument that some people make against Chelsea Manning, that Chelsea Manning just turned over files without. You know, did not sit and vet things that we just said, look, look at what's going on, and just threw the whole pile of garbage or whatever you want to call it on the table. And for that reason, people make the argument that Chelsea endangered uh, the lives of people that were cooperating with us in Afghanistan and whatever. What is your answer to, to those? Uh, well, my answer is, whatever that case may be, the Pentagon endangers lives of people throughout the world. 10,000 times more than whatever Chelsea could have possibly done, and they do it on a daily basis. Isn't, Not, it, isn't it funny how the, how what we do militarily, we can kill thousands or millions of people, and not a word is said, but you know, one person causes one American to die, citizen or military person, suddenly they're the scourge of the earth. Exactly, right. But, How did you become a veteran for peace? I mean, what war were you in? What caused you to 
Develop yourself to this call. I'm a veteran of the Israeli Defense Forces, and while our chapter is predominantly U.S. military veterans, we do have veterans of other armed forces, including uh, the Iranian Air Force. So um, I'm the elected president of the chapter, and really the veterans movement now, in the second decade of the 21st century, is becoming globalized. Uh, if, if there was any defense of, of uh, I mean, uh, militarism, uh, it seems to me that Israel is the most justified because, I mean, it's surrounded by millions of people that want to destroy it. And it's a democracy, and well, I mean, Israel, they have a gay pride in Israel, but they don't have it in any of the countries surrounding it. They chop off our heads and throw us off of towers in Iran and Iraq and... Well, that's a whole other issue. Um, Israel, is a Israel is not a democracy. It may be a democracy for a percentage of the population, but it's not a democracy yeah, I know, for I know, the I know you have a hundred Jewish people, you have a hundred different opinions. I had a good friend now to see to use to be a big supporter of the Palestinian cause. Okay. Which I, I personally, I, I don't want to avoid all those details. So right. what, what, but can, at any what, rate, what's going to happen? With, is there any appeal underway with Chelsea? Is there uh, any Chelsea does have a uh, legal team uh, about, behind her. How about but, Wilkie? Is Julian Assange, has he done anything uh, supportive in regards to Chelsea? I, I don't know. Um, I know he himself is being dogged by... Oh, I know uh, that. I just think he's a fellow refugee from the intelligence services. But, but at any rate, let me just sum up by, okay. by just saying that Chelsea is dear to our hearts. Uh, we work every day to raise consciousness about her. Um, I was, what, I was what, this what website should they people go for? Go um, to. ChelseaManningSolidarity.org is a place to start. Okay, well, okay. Thanks, thanks. Thanks so much. Thank you.